<laughs> I don't mind you fucking her is one of the perks, but she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in, have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay, uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Wei do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Wei? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I, you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. <laughs> nah, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Who are you? I'm Way. Ricky sent me. Didn't he tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi, it's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speed? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Uh, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? What's the deal, Way? You a gangster like Ricky? He's not a gangster, don't say that. Let's say I'm as much of a gangster as Ricky. Oh, that's too bad. Recently I've wanted to date a gangster. Well, maybe I'll see if I can find one for you. That would be nice. What's Ricky doing anyways? Why is he too busy? I don't know. Uh, something with Sonny. Sonny? That guy's a creep and a perv. Sorry, baby. It's okay. What? What'd he do? Nothing. But he tried. I was at a party on Wallace Chung's yacht. I was like, 16. I got so high. <laughs> Great party. Anyways, Sonny was there. He was all, impress me and maybe I'll make you a star. He wanted me to fuck this old guy he was with and Sonny wanted to watch. I was like, no thanks, you sleazy perv. Do you know who you... That's him, that's him, pull up. Hi, Alex, how are you? Huh, this is your new boyfriend? Not yet, why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey, so Sandra says you like to race. How about it? Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Wait. I'm not sure how much that's worth. Okay. We race for the girls and a hundred thousand. Sure, I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex. Because you're gonna need it. Think of it as your head start. I'll show him.
Oh my god, my heart is beating so fast. Hey. <laughs> Steady hands. Gotta give you that. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, get a room, you two. Oh, shit! The police! Now, cops, perfect. it out. But you can take me for a drive anytime. Wow, I just take you up on that. Oh, get it. I'm all excited out. But you can take me for a drive anytime. Wow, I just take you up on that. Oh, get a room, you two. I think that's a that's a bit later. Oh, you are a confident bastard. I like that. But I'm promising nothing. You take me racing, and we'll... Oh, that's it, just over there. <clears throat> that was fun, Way. <laughs> Thanks. Anytime. Vivi, give Way my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. Yeah, sure. What's going on? My friend Katushka. She's gone missing. Nobody's seen her in a week. Katushka doesn't have a visa. She's... she's illegal. Girls like her go missing all the time, but usually they don't have anywhere to go for help. I'll check it out. Would you? Oh, thank you. How am I supposed to do my job when you keep stonewalling me at every fucking turn? Fine, sir. I, I understand. I just... I'll, I'll figure it out. Everything all right? These fucking politicians. They, they want me to clean up the streets, but they won't give me the resources I need to do it. Well, I got something for you, and I'm all you need to close yeah, it. Yeah, well, it better be good. I'm in a pretty shitty mood right now, I'm not gonna lie. Kidnapping down at the K-Bar, Russian hostess, probably here illegally. Now, I'm gonna investigate it further, but I wanted to give you the heads up. You know, I keep waiting for the other shoe to drop with you, but you've really helped us out a lot lately. Let me know what you find. Have you filmed out anything? Not yet. Did Katushka have any favorite clients? Guys that liked her particularly? You know, anything like that? You should talk to Mr. Chen. He had a real thing for her. I think they were, um, how do you say it? Uh, special friends. You Chen? It's Mr. Chen to you. What do you want? I got a couple questions about Katushka. Why the hell would I tell you anything? My name's Wei Shen. Maybe you heard of me. Little shits like you aren't usually so fast to insult the son on Yi. Wait, wait, Wei Shen. I'm so sorry, Mr. Shen. I didn't know. I have nothing but respect for that son on Yi. Please, I will help you any way I can. How do you know Katushka? We are friends. Friends? 
Don't fuck with me, Chan. Okay, okay. We had an arrangement. I pay for her apartment, got her clothes, jewelry. She was uh, appreciative. Have you seen her recently? No, no, for a week at least. She hasn't returned my calls either. Where is this apartment? I'll give you the address. Anything else? She asked me to get her papers, a visa, but I do not know how to get papers. I cannot marry her. I got a wife already, you know? Dang, it's way. I need you to run a phone number for me. Five 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 zero one five one four. I'll call you back. Way, you might have found your man. The number belongs to Yarkwai Lai, Fisherman Lai. He's affiliated with 18K. Runs a number of businesses along the waterfront. We think he's heavily into their smuggling operation. Know where I can find him? He likes to gamble. Frequents a little place in Central. I'll text you the address in his mugshot. Good. Maybe I can plan a bug on him, see where he takes the girls. How are you gonna do that? I'm gonna lose it to him. At poker. Good evening, sir. How you doing? Hey, so how does a man get to the highest stakes table? You talk to me. <laughs> well, I'm feeling especially lucky today. You're always welcome here. Excuse me, miss. Where can I find the high stakes table? Just over there. That's Mr. Yar's domain. This is weak tea, motherfucker. <laughs> weak tea! You ladies ready to lose your money? What? Who are you? I don't know you. Get lost. Mr. Yar, is it? Is that the way you talk to Sun on Yi? I don't care about no Sun on Yi. Only money talks at this table. Then let's get the conversation going. Have a seat. I enjoy watching people lose. <laughs> let's make it interesting. What are you bet against a hot Russian blonde? A blonde? Yeah. Got this girl over at K-Bar. Very hot. And she's, uh... You might say, in my debt. You win this hand, I deliver her to you. You crazy? You want a better girl? What am I going to do with her if I win her? She's illegal, no papers. You can do anything you want with her. Oh, yeah? All right, brother. K-Bar has the hottest girls in the city, and I could use another blonde. Besides, I'm feeling lucky. Too bad for you. Bring the girl to the docks at Central. Come play again. Maybe next time I win twins. Where are you? 
Liana, it's way. Did you find her? Not yet, but I found a man who may have her. What are you going to do next? I arranged for him to take another girl. I'll follow him and see if he leads us to Katushka. That other girl, you're talking about me, aren't you? Yes. You ready? Yes. Now I'm going to put a tracking device on you. I should be able to follow you wherever you go. Okay. You nervous? A little. Look, I'll be behind you the whole way. Thanks, Wei. I really appreciate the help. I know Katushka will too. Nobody else there looks out for girls like us. It's good to know we have you on our side. This your friend? Uh-huh. I told her you'd help her sort out that immigration problem. Oh, yeah. We'll sort that out. Come on, honey. get you out of here, all right? Relax. Yeah, we're okay. Can you get us out of here? Maybe. Give me a second. You're not like the others, Way. There's something about you. You 
better keep a low profile for a while. Wei is the most decent gangster I know. I told you he would save us. We snatched up Fisherman Lai and his entire gang, plus 22 women they were holding in two other locations. This is one of those cases nobody was paying attention to. If you hadn't cracked it, every one of those girls would have been forced into prostitution. Or worse. You've made a real difference, Officer Shen. Thanks. That's the last file I have open. I won't need you again for a while. Keep safe, Wei. Ah, Wei! Fun ying, fun ying, fun ying. Kind of you to join me. Care for some tea? Lai Lai, yum di ta. Thank you. Tu Jin Sao seems to be getting very comfortable in his new position as temporary chairman. Too comfortable. I hear that he is already planning to make it permanent, should Uncle Po not recover. Um, Big Smile Lee will kill him before he'll let that happen. Indeed. And that would allow Lee to take over the Sun On Yi himself. But that can't happen. No, it cannot. Tu Jin must go. Dan Hai, he must not be removed by force. He must step down on his own, after which there will be an election. Why would he step down? Tu Jin likes heroin. So far, he has managed to control his habit. Dan Hai, anyone who indulges as he does, lives permanently on the brink of an abyss. Nah, I've arranged for the quality of his supply to improve. And now, you will give him a nudge. Over the edge. Okay. How? He is an immensely superstitious man. Ho Mai Sunga, obsessed with feng shui. He cannot bear to have the slightest thing out of place for fear of the misfortune it will bring. And you want me to make sure his luck turns bad. Very bad. <laughs> I like your style. I will. What's your problem, kid? Mrs. Chen want you to talk to me. Hey, you broken noses, guy? Mrs. He told me to tag along. Give you feng shui advice. Feng shui, ah! A lot of people live by it. Feng shui is huge in Hong Kong. You believe that? Yeah. I've been spending a lot of time reading about ghosts and the supernatural. Want to make sure nobody I kill can hurt me. <laughs> you know what I mean? A delivery for you? Really? My husband didn't tell me. He better not have ordered something stupid from the internet again. Uh, you got all kinds of skills, don't you, kid? Reminds me of myself when I was your age, but less salty. <laughs> I bet you smarter, but probably not as tough. Oh, I pulled a muscle down. As any professional athlete. <laughs> so, uh, how's business? To be honest, Sanya, pretty damn shitty. Really? What happened? I'm taking a break from the import export gig. How come? Uh, something went wrong. I don't really want to talk about it. All right, suit yourself. Dog got out. 
we don't find it before he comes back, and heads will roll. Oh, shit. I haven't seen it. Open the gate from the inside. Hell, fucking tell me to wait here. Huh? <clears throat> Open for the door. Come on. Wow, you're pretty and talented. What? I said you're pretty talented. Oh, okay, sure. You too, Salty. Sounds the same as death in Chinese. I know four is bad, but shouldn't we try something else? <laughs> We're some pretty unoriginal ghosts. Chow, is that you? Anybody in there? What do we do? Just hide. Stay calm. From the golden coin soon, I'll be right down. They're gone. Come on. Keijia, Tu Chin loses money fast. We better hurry up. Ayya, deal! There's a camera. Looks like wrong camera. Oh, God, Tana. I hate how everyone got security cameras everywhere. Don't worry. Take care of it. So, uh, why do they call you old Salty Crab? Uh, well, that was this restaurant guy who owed me money. Couldn't pay. He told me I could eat for free at his restaurant until he paid. That way, I wouldn't cut off his hand like I normally would. Salt so Crab was the most expensive thing on the menu. I had that every night for about a year. Nina. So they used to. Oh shit, I think he's home. Get down! Officer, the. Can you watch here? 
Those cards must have been rigged. I never had a game like that before. Never! Why, why didn't you stop me? It's your job to protect me, isn't it? Fucking rodents. All of you. What is this? Look at this. How can you let this happen? It's all gone to shit. Gone to shit. What do you want us to do, boss? Get out. Get out. I need to think. Wait. The guard left their car. Let's check it. Wait, wait, wait. Let's take the guard's car. Ah, damn well. I always wanted to get myself one of these. <laughs> one of these? <laughs> really? Ah, yeah, okay, man. I am. You're a strange guy, old salty crab. Thanks. That means a lot to me. Hey, I have a delivery here from the Golden Coin. Hurry up. I've been waiting for you for hours. Nice work, kid. You got your salty style. I comes in. See you later, kid. Old salty style. Hello. Wait. Miss Chang. How are you? Uncle Po. He's dead. We're making arrangements for the funeral. Things could get, uh... Complicated. Yes. I'll be in touch. Of course. Whatever you need. Way! How'd the date with Vivian go? You want to be her new boyfriend? <laughs> Relax, Ricky. I'm just making a joke. So, wait. You know Fifi Meow? You mean the movie star? Yeah, I heard of her. What's she doing these days? She's doing another movie in the Stripper Assassin franchise. But I want the role for Vivian. That's a great idea. That would be huge for Vivian. Yeah, it would help her profile. Aren't you going with Vivian to the release party? Yeah, you're right. Good call. We're releasing the track that King produced tonight. You have a great time. You and the hottest star in Hong Kong. Go, have fun. You know Big Smile Lee? Oh yeah, we've crossed paths. Good. We've got a joint venture making porn. He brings the girls, I bring the production and distribution. That's good money, I bet. Yeah, if Vivian pisses me off, that's where she'll end up. But there's more money if I keep her a star. I just have to make sure she doesn't flake out on me. I want you to put some cameras up in an apartment. I need it done right away. Can you organize that for me? Yeah, of course, Sonny. I'll take care of it for you. Okay. Here's the address. There's a box of stuff over by the elevator. Excuse me, sir. I don't think I've seen you before. I'm a location scout. Could you let me have a look around? Only residents and their guests are allowed, sir. Now be quick. I'll make it worth your while. No. It's not gonna happen, sir. You have to leave the premises, sir.
not. Shit! I don't need a message. That could be really bad. We have to send him a message. I don't know what his problem is, but we don't have to worry about it. Did he know who you were? <laughs> yeah, you should have seen him. We should get out of here soon. Oh, wow, that sounds nice. I'm doing a tour, but it'll be done in August. I guess you know what you're You look doing. beyond beautiful tonight. Every time you I looked at that? you, all I could think was, <laughs> I can't believe she's real. Oh, Ricky. She's too perfect to be real. Seriously. Every woman wanted to be you, and every guy wanted to. <laughs> well, you know. Oh, Ricky, you have such a one-track mind. Shit. Fuck me, Sonny. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> you know I like that. Okay, <laughs> but let me go freshen up first. Whatever you want, baby. I'm gonna go have a smoke. Yeah, hey, Sonny. Nah, nah, everything went great. Yeah. Yeah, he was there. He was impressed. Yeah, you should have seen him. Oh, and now that you mention it, maybe I should check up on her. There you are. Are you fucking crazy? What the hell were you thinking of wrestling Jackie, huh? Oh, I thought we were past all that. I just wanted to congratulate you on that business with Tang. Good riddance. Now, what about Sonny Woe? Anything new there? What about Jackie, huh? Fuck, Penju. Are you deaf? No, Officer Shane, I'm not. But you clearly have forgotten who you're speaking to. Way. Forget about Jackie a moment. Whatever we can get to stick to Sonny Woe will obviously hurt Big Smile Lee. And we both want that. Fine. Sonny had me put up a hidden camera in Vivian Lou's bedroom. She and Ricky nearly caught me. He always did have a reputation for that sort of thing. Think you could get a copy of that? Are you fucking kidding me? She's got nothing to do with this shit. This could be the piece that we're missing on Sonny. Can you get it? All right. But I want Jackie in return. Cut him loose. Very well. Get me the video and he walks. I'll get it. All right, I have to go. Get me that video as soon as you can. I found one of your statues. The rooster. Good, good. You don't look well, Wei. Is everything all right? No, Sifu. What do you plan to do about it? It is what it is. So if your punches are weak, that means the destined to be weak? Or is it true that through practice and concentration, you can change? Some problems are harder to solve than a weak punch, Sifu. Watch my students for a minute. You may change your mind. <sighs> All right, Penju, I hope you're happy. Vivian? What are you doing here? Well, Sonny says you've been really helpful to him. And to me. And I just wanted to thank you. Vivian, no. <sighs> wait, wait. What's this about? N nothing. I just... I just can't... God, Sonny's gonna kill me. Wait, Sonny sent you here? Yeah, don't you know that... Know what? I, I just... I can't do it anymore. Sonny will just... So you'll just have to get another girl. Look, Vivian, you don't need to. Not with me, okay? So, you mean you're okay with it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Wow, you're... You're the first guy who's ever... I mean... Thanks, Way. Way, did you bring the video? 
And Jackie? Done. This should be all I need to put Sonny Wo away for a long time. And with Uncle Poe dead... Wait, how'd you hear about that? Good news travels fast. I'll have Raymond arrange your debriefing. Congratulations, Wei. What are you saying? I'm saying it's over. You've done your job. It's time to come in. It's not over. Not yet. Wei, the Sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Your mission was an unbelievable success. I must admit, I thought you'd be happy. Big Smiley will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. I can't come in now. I'm not finished yet. I understand your personal reasons for doing this, your history with the Sun on Yi. This is why I selected you. But you've done more than enough. Those are my orders. Fuck your orders and fuck you too, Penju. I came on to take down the Sun on Yi, not to shuffle the deck. Shen, you're making a mistake. Way, the Sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Big smile will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. Shen, you're making a mistake. Fuck your orders. Fuck you too, Penju. What do you want? Your friend Jackie. It's agreed he'll be walking out of Joe in a few minutes. Just thought you might want to be there to pick him up. Thanks. Don't mention it.